Hey, this is Mike. It's not super dark out here, but uh, this is about as best as I'm going to get right now as far as the nighttime video on the 2015 uh, Dodge Charger. So hopefully you can see here in the front, it has like a halo ring and a LED. You got your LED fog lights there at the bottom. And then the halo ring right here. Right around there, it's like a half, like a half halo, I guess you can say. Let's see what it looks like. If I go directly in front of it, it kind of blinds out the camera, but you can see it better on an angle. But there's three LEDs. That's one of the one of the differences there on the um, on the fog lights is it's got three LEDs at the bottom. Got a side marker there, side marker here. Right now, I just have the parking lights on, and here's the back. It looks similar to the like the glow of the Durango or the Dart. Then you've got the, the license plate light there. Let me go ahead and turn the headlights on. Alright. Now this has the projector, high intensity projector beams there. Alright, now I'm going to turn the headlights off so it doesn't blind anybody driving and I'm going to turn the turn signals on. Alright. So let me open up the trunk. See what it looks like in there. All right, so we've got a, a light here and a light there, and it seems to illuminate pretty good. I mean, I can see very clear, um, pretty much any angle. So if I can put my hand in there, um, since there's two points of light, it. Uh, there's no real dark shadows and it even illuminates up in here too it's pretty good let's look under here look at the spare tire we can see all that very clearly and the and the um, battery too all right let's look in the back seat all right so there's a light here yeah, it's underneath the door here. Um, that's kind of shining uh, there for your, so you can step in. And you've got a light here, and the little tiny ambient light here where the the water bottle holder is. The power window is backlit. There's the ambient light there. Seats are well lit by these lights here. Let's see here. Yeah, the light there and the light over there and of course the, the lights in the front as well and you got an that light over there with the door is uh, it's kind of shining through there plus you got your uh, heated seats and your USB ports are backlit Turn that radio down. All right, so here's the inside of the door. I wish it was a little bit darker, but you can see it has a uh, ambient light there where the handle is. Your presets for your power seat is are um, are backlit. All these buttons here, your door lock controls, power windows, and side mirror adjustments are all backlit. And your fuel cap button is backlit. 
plus you have a little light here that shines on your uh, your pocket there and you have a, a light under the door all right so the dome lights pretty bright you can see the, the floor you can see the seats well everything's uh, lit up pretty good now let me shut the door so all the dome lights will go out I'm still getting some light from the this this street light here but I think we can kind of get the idea there is some ambient light in the floorboard here and cup holders are that are lit up you got your uh, headlight controls are um, are lit up here now the the scroll on the the dimmer switch is uh, right now it's all the way up almost the right there is all the way up it turns on the in, the interior lights pull it down one click and now all the interior lights are basically as bright as they're gonna get same thing with the ambient light which is a little dimmer switch next to it steering wheel you get everything backlit there all the relevant buttons your gauges very bright when you turn it up I'm just gonna kind of scroll through the here so you can just see what what everything looks like I like the way the the number looks it's like a like a racing number or something pretty cool I wonder what kind of font that is if you know what kind of font that is let me know I'd like to use that sometime or something similar to it start button is eliminated of course the touch screen is illuminated and you can turn that off um, let's see here screen off don't see a screen off button wonder if they did it away, did away with that in a 15 model or maybe it's in a spot that I'm not aware of maybe you can tell me is that usually it's right here in this area where you can turn the screen off not seeing that maybe you can just adjust the the brightness or something maybe that's all it is so anyway there's your let's see what the navigation looks like that's pretty bright when you have the when you have the dimmer switch turned up there's all your redundant buttons down here now the the shifter is very bright I mean it's like giving off a lot of light and it's even casting some light up here all these backlit buttons here are kind of getting light shine on them from the shifter power supply has some backlit light now I'm gonna go ahead and put the shifter in reverse see what the backup camera looks like yeah very clear at nighttime now I mean it is not 100% dark here but you know it is um, I have been in some darker situations and it's, it's pretty bright parking sensors pop up now I don't have anybody to help me or I would uh, put it in reverse and show you what the backup um, lights look like but you know I'm just kinda by myself doing a quick video All right, cup holders. And now if it washes a little bit darker, because let's see here if I can cover up some of the light. Yeah, because you got like these little um, circles around the cup holders, which are really neat. This lifts up. And inside this center console, um, you've got some backlit USB, SD, and auxiliary inputs, as well as a power supply there. glove compartment has a pretty decent light more so on the top than the bottom deep in the pot in the bottom of the glove compartment it's not really eliminated that much up here we've got the rear view mirror and you've got eliminated assist button and 911 um, no lights in there this is all eliminated for your garage door controls your touch um, spotlight and floodlight and then uh, this is your 
This one has a sunroof, but there's the controls for it here. Visor has lights in it and a mirror. Same thing on that side. Now I'm noticing there's a little bit of ambient light here in this pocket. I don't know if you can see that. It's not very bright. And and also, I mean, being underneath the street light's not really <laughs> not really helping with uh, some of it, but I think you can pick it up in the video pretty good. Not seeing any Yeah, yeah, there is. Uh, over there in the passenger floorboard there is some ambient light there but it's very faint and with the dark carpet you can barely see it I don't know if you can pick it up in the video but there is some real slight amount of ambient light down there so you can see it better on this side because there's this white paper um, so you can actually see it better and you can see my the shadow of my foot so it's the same thing on that side it's just shining on black carpet all right Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. I'm going to go ahead and turn everything off here. But, um, see what it looks like out there at night. All right. Well, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. And, um, please share the video if you like it, and rate it, and subscribe, whatever you want to do. See you next time.